All right, 3.7. What could we possibly have left to do in Sumeru? Whoa! You must be the legendary traveler! I've heard a lot about you! Who the heck is this? Are you following the tournament too? It's a pleasure to meet you! I'm Charlotte, a reporter for the Steambird from Fontaine. I've been posted here to cover the King of Charlotte Invocations Grand Prix. Since you've also taken interest in the tournament, how King would you like to be a special contributor for my column? Yeah, of course you'll receive payment as a contributor, and your name will even tournament? appear in the credits. So let's have a look. Okay. Hmm? Show me do what's my going ears on. deceive me? Or do you two have some breaking news to share with me? And <laughs> this is music. Card snatcher? Hmm. How very interesting. You get him, Sino. Like teams with talent in TCG tournament as young prodigy best Favonian cavalry captain. Down on the ground, the dice spin around. So is this whole version going to be about a sky, card tournament? Bright. All right. <laughs> Say really? your piece, challenger. I, Aida Harakazuha, humbly accept this duel. Inazuma's Archon bolts her way to the semifinals like, game's cool and all, but... stunned by a crafty opponent. I don't know about like a whole group <laughs> nerve. Just being Saying about a tournament. In the presence of me and A? Well, they think from Inazuma won't be able to reach me in Fontaine, right? Oh, that's a good question. Let's you find must out. be tired after the walk back to shore. She kind of looks like I should let you go first. If this red tofu with all the frills hasn't gotten too cold, I would be happy to play. Tournament? The tournament has already finished. I what? used forbidden hand at the opportune moment. Rest assured, there's no destination I can't deliver to. Thank you for choosing Comania oh. Express. You're the cat girl. Actual cat girl, not a fake cat girl. I think. Those cat poses. Are those her? Does she have like cat feet? Wow. Are those are real feet. So this is Sumeru. There are so many huge mushrooms here. They're big enough to lie on. Oh boy. We'll let Yoi Mia into Sumeru. <laughs> She's gonna start a forest fire. <laughs> Hello, everyone. Welcome to the Genshin Impact version 3.7 oh, uh, special program. Here. I'm your host, Instead Sarah Miller Cruz, the voice of Lumine, and I have a new friend here with me. Make sure the truth comes first Where's that and report stories in the bottom right and stand out the most. Charlotte will be heading to several nations to gather her news materials. Okay, oh, there that it is. explains There's why we the, see so many friends from different creature. nations in the picture here. Was it a cat in a box? Does that mean that she's going to be traveling around to that then? <laughs> you bet. As a foreign Just correspondent, you should definitely be checking out the event venues in different locations. Next, we have Zero Hour Invocation, which is an unofficial tournament organized for our passionate TCG players. Unlike the official tournament matches, this format adopts a special rule set, so you won't be able to use your own decks. Oh. Instead, you will have to build a deck by selecting cards out of the decks prepared by the organizers. And chances are, you'll get to okay. duel against some familiar faces. <laughs> okay. Is there a bunch of new cards? Sounds like fun already. So All right. Have, like, what a about lead, ever motion mechanical painting and part of the dice? I still have something else to report. Oh, okay. In version 3.7, there'll not only be a genius invocation event, Radiant but also Secret? a major update to the TCG game itself. What? Oh, okay, Cards that's awesome. Archons? What can we expect to see in the new update then? So, in the upcoming version, many new cards will be added to Genius Invocation TCG, including character cards, monster cards, and action cards. Amazing, okay, right? That's cool. <laughs> yeah. And it's also noteworthy that the cards of the Animo, Geo, Electro, and Dendro Archons will also be available after the update. Ooh. So, we can expect to see some incredible and fun new decks. Nice. Okay, that's going to be quite the update. I wonder and how good more. they're going to be. So, with so many cards being added, how could we fully enjoy them without some new game modes? So, in version 3.7, the Arena of Champions mode will be available too. And and what'll be different about this mode? Glad you asked. It's in this mode, mode, travelers must use Not their deck interested. to duel against each other and accumulate a total of five victories. Okay, so another TCG mode is called the Forge Realms Temper, which will also be available. 
You'll be allowed to okay, configure the PB difficulty mode. of the game mode, as well as to choose from a bunch of additional conditions to score extra points. Okay, perfect. I'll definitely be picking some conditions that suit my decks the best. <laughs> so it's like... No, oh God, what, it's making what's noise. What's happening? <laughs> what is going that on? sounds cute. Where is it coming from? <laughs> oh, she turned I into the so character. I got so caught up in listening to you two talking that I almost forgot that I'm on the job. That's just Kirara's job. She is a courier like no other. More like courier. Ooh. Oh, no. Yes, if we're done. <laughs> oh, boy. But before we get to hear more about Kirara, why don't we check her out first? Yay! Let's do it. All right, Whoa, let's learn about the cat. The girl. scenery here is wonderful. <laughs> I've landed the perfect job. Oh, is she like a? Is she just fighting with her hands and feet? Coming through. So what's her weapon? Is she like catalyst, like Hazo? Service with a smile. Okay. Everyone is waiting to learn more to learn more about this yokai courier's abilities. Absolutely, yes, correct. Mm, for sure. sure. What does she do? Let's move so into Kirara's dendro, skills. But what's her <laughs> weapon? Kirara is a dendro element sword user and can oh, she uses effectively a sword. assist her companions while also okay. making world exploration more efficient. Okay, her attacks look amazing. She swipes Does she ever like actually use the sword? Or is it, it just like a Hazo yeah. catalyst she thing? She is a Nekomata after all. Uh, by tapping her elemental skill, Kirara creates a Dendro Shield that can protect her from harm. Okay, shields okay. are great. Dendro Shielder. They'll keep both her and the delivery safe, which is Love all that shield. matters. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and holding down the elemental skill will not only grant shields, but also put Kirara <laughs> she in She actually the turns into the cat cool. box. So the whole thing is that that's the cutest thing I've ever seen in my what entire life, and I need you to immediately tell me more about it right meow. <laughs> Oh, oh, no problem gosh. at all. Thank you, yes. In <laughs> that this is state, so silly Kirara looking. Kirara will deal dendro damage upon slamming into enemies, but more uniquely, <laughs> you can ram enemies. This state will also drastically oh my increase gosh. her movement and climbing speed, along with her jumping ability. Okay, um, Wait, she can that sounds climb like useful. that? So, just so I can get this straight, she'll be able to just Show me. climb straight up walls? Oh, yeah, she'll be able to go straight up a vertical surface. Oh, my gosh. Stage. Um, okay. Amazing. Mm. I feel like they're taking ever. notes from Mother and Wings. She's going to be so great for exploring. And I guess that's one of the Just reasons climb. why she's a trustworthy courier. <laughs> mm -hmm. That's so funny and looking. finally, with her elemental burst, she smashes the enemy with a special delivery package, which then explodes into numerous small dendro bombs. These bombs will then explode upon contacting enemies or after a duration, dealing dendro damage. And can we just appreciate the fact can you that even, like, the bombs are kitty shaped? Pyro them I'm or electro them like dendro cores? <laughs> and yeah! so cute! Because oh. you have information on Yoimiya's story quest! Story quest? I totally act do. Two I was for just being a little <laughs> <laughs> I think this is the first okay, time so, they've done an act Sakoku two for an, a non archive. Right? And Yoimiya has right? been wanting to go out and see the outside That's interesting. world. In version 3.7, the second act to Yoimiya's Karasius Arata story quest is about to begin! Woohoo! She will be embarking on a that being said, Fenty still doesn't adventure, have an act two. heading to Sumeru, the Nation of Wisdom, alongside the Traveler. So, for further details about 3.7's event wishes, so is Kirara please a five star direct your attention to the big screen. Ta-da! Oh, oh, where did that come from? Oh, She's a I four just star. remembered that we're today's okay. reporters. <clears throat> what? Oh, Wait, Mia according and Miko to reliable banners. sources, the first half of 3.7's event wishes will boost drop rates for Yoimiya and Yaimiko. At the same time, Kirara will also be making her debut in these event wishes, so travelers who want Kirara might want to take note. And the second okay. half of version 3.7's event Kazuha, wishes will see them. Kaidahara, Kazuha, and, and I'll hate them getting their own reruns. Sarah, why are you talking like that? I was going to say he's already reporters. getting a rerun, but... Thanks, Sarah. With when the help was of their original banner? We hope that all our travelers will be I able forget. to keep happily exploring Tavad. And now to Jenny with the weather. The weather is still weather. What? Anyways, <laughs> when travelers follow Yoimiya to Sumeru, they might also encounter their old friend Kabe. This is because Kabe's very hang own hangout Kabe. event will okay. also be available in version 3.7. In version 3.7, the Divine Ingenuity Collector's Chapter event will be available. Oh, I remember this event. What the heck is this? this is the one that lets you design your own domain. Oh, that's so cool. Right? Oh, that's what this is. However, this event's gameplay has been upgraded a bit. So just to confirm, so can we, we can use all of our own while we're domains? making our own domains. Yes, yes. <sighs> or did the domains the we create still just the coin collection? Coins, travelers can also adjust how many stages are active per room and opponent settings. 
Even buffs and buff bestowers can be placed inside these stages. Wait, you- that's so cool! Okay, so it sounds like the Travelers will have even more creative freedom this time around. So, okay, what this I'm gathering really cool. is that everyone should use their imagination <laughs> this time. Okay. There will also be co-op mechanics for oh, this game. And mode. there's co-op? So if there's a stage you can't beat on your own, you can bring your friends and try the challenges. Or uh, fall into Jenny's This could be together. so much fun yeah. if you can <laughs> and remember, make your own domain combat domains and do them in co-op. Also, their own designs before they'll be able to share them with others. Ooh, departed okay, this is kind of like just boss <laughs> fighting <laughs> combat. I thought so too. Event. They're each based on the Thunder Manifestation, Eon Blight Drake, and the Bethysmal Bishop Herd, respectively. Travelers can also add additional conditions to their difficulty yeah, so this is like the, in this uh, challenge. With increased difficulty resulting in greater rewards. What was it called? The, the hypostasis okay, event? Okay, I, I think I get the gist of this one. This one is another returning event for version 3.7 called Phase Trials. Phase Trials Hypothesis. So maybe some of that you remember familiar, Jamie, I don't the Sumeru remember what that researcher is. who was struggling with his thesis proposal. Okay, so during the event, travelers can defeat enemies to gain phase tinctures. When to get enough phase tinctures, they can use them to enter the time dilation state. Oh, this was that weird event where you take pictures of the enemies and they explode. And select opportune moments to capture more weaknesses in their opposition before using their super sense skill to deal massive damage. Ooh, all right. This is the end of our program. Thank you so much for watching, everyone. Bye. Oh, bye. <laughs> bye. 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 Oh, we got one little extra bit here. Is this a fontaine thing? We have underwater stuff. Ooh. Is he underwater? It's kind of hard to tell. He could have been above the water. So, looks like for 3.7, we are in full-on filler mode. There is no main story, no new zones, nothing. Just just events. We're not even getting a new 5-star, we're just getting a new 4-star. So, full-on filler update. Which is a shame, but at least on the bright side, it looks like the events will be pretty good this time around, which is not usually something I say. The new character seems hilarious with her skill turning into a box and being able to climb walls. I look forward to seeing people do that in co-op. I think I'm really looking forward to this event. If we can make our own like combat domains and do them in co-op, I could see this being one of the most fun events they've ever done. Like possibly the best event ever. But we'll have to see if if you can do that. I'm not sure how limited it's going to be with being able to like place enemies and and do stuff. Because like if you can make your own custom dungeons with this with enemies and do them in co-op, this will absolutely be just the best event ever. Okay, I also want to talk about real quick uh, Fontaine or specifically 4.0. So we did get like a, a little weird preview at the end of... Aether is swimming. It seems like he was swimming underwater. Uh, which is really cool. It seems like that's probably something we'll be doing in Fontaine. But that wasn't like a full-on like Fontaine preview like they usually do. Which means we're probably getting another version 3 update before we go to 4.0. So I expect a 3.8. Are we going to go to the archipelago again? <laughs> I guess we'll find out in 6 weeks. But until then... I will see you later.